I've thought about this idea for a while as a player since I've been diving into single player games lately. When I beat a game, there are some that just leave me in awe of how amazing the experience was. At the end of the game, I've often thought I wish I could give these... What, just more money? I often thought I wish I could give these folks another 10 or 20 dollars because it was worth more than my initial 70 and they didn't try to nickel and dime me every second. I know $70 is already a lot, but it's an option at the end of the game I wish I had at times. Some games are that special. I know most will dislike this idea, smile. By the way, I realize we are tired of tipping and everything else, but I view this different from a pressure to tip type scenario. Many face to get- Isn't this why we buy DLC? <laughs> Isn't that what this is? Because we carry on playing the game? Of merchandise or yeah exactly isn't this why we continue to play the game or i could already see the Baldur's gate uh, larian just being like dude what the fuck somebody's going to implement this now like hoping for a chance in their arm on this my key bar says just <sighs> the tip i'm really sad he's gone from blizzard though i'm really sad i'm really sad <laughs> i'm really sad <laughs> I'm so sad. Uh, yeah, that, that's pushing the wrong buttons. This is uh, any this... tippers who who just tip, just give more money, guys. Just give more money. Look, will you guys stop trusting the companies that you're buying your products from to charge you appropriately, you idiots? Clearly, clearly, I get what he's saying, but this works for games like. If I was to throw a bone here, it works for games like Path of Exile. It's fully free to play. I have absolutely no issue buying things from grinding gear that i probably don't particularly need because they give you this amazing game for free it's entirely free but if i've paid 70 dollars for a fucking video game no dude no dude no or an indie game if i think the best way genuinely speaking is not to tip the devs but if you get a sick as fuck indie game and you're like, this game is fucking gangster. Months. Like, I hope you had an amazing Outer holiday. Wilds, right? Well like deserved. Outer Wilds for me. If uh, if if you've got this game and you have the disposable income for it, buy it for a friend who probably wouldn't pick it up. I think that is a totally fair way of doing that. It's like, dude, here, tr play this fucking game. I know if I left it to you, you wouldn't buy it. Because how many times do we recommend a game to a friend? And we're like, oh yeah, you're probably not going to play this. It's awesome. Just send it to a friend and like that the devs get a slice of the pie, that's all work. <laughs> or buy the soundtrack. Yeah, like stuff like that is totally fine. Totally, totally fine. But I I am absolutely never gonna go down the any level of encouragement for tipping devs. Do oh Starfall, thank you so much, Starfall. Thank you. At the end of every LFR2? <sighs> they would try, they would try. So like so you could pay the devs less. Yeah, and I absolutely I totally agree. I do not trust him to not be looking to try and start something at some point which is like oh we can pay you less and we'll give you a cut of the post game profits as an incentive for you to make a better game right i can totally see some fucking greedy well, talking scrooge mcduck Wilds, ass motherfucker being like hey let's pay the guys less video, but we'll definitely give you a profit share at the back end based on the tips that you get for making a really good game Right? And then we'll have some scheme where you'll get a minimum, but you'll get more and all this. Yeah, exactly. I don't trust these motherfuckers who sit on mountains of cash watching line go up, not to be trying to be like, the best way of making line go up is to pay people less. Because the less we pay for it, the more line go up. Because we're not going to make the game cheaper. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yo, your game didn't make a lot of tips. Unlucky. There you go unlucky sad times sad times uh okay i have this <laughs> let's see how this goes